Hi there, welcome to Gateway Plugins tutorial series. Today I'm going to show you how you can control variation swatches size in the product and shop archive pages according to your need. For demonstration purpose, I have created a variable product. You can notice the variations of this product are in default size currently. If you need to increase the size of this variation globally, head to the product backend and navigate to advanced tab from the swatches settings. Set your desired height, width and font size. I am going to set 40 for width, height and 20 for font size. Save the settings and return back to the product frontend. You can notice my product variation are now looking large, right? Suppose I have 3 attributes for rest of my store variable products. I want to make only color attribute a bit larger than others. To do that, make sure you have premium version of WooCommerce variation swatches plugin activated. Get inside the special attribute tab from the swatches settings. From the large size attribute section, check show attribute in large setting, choose color from choose attribute setting and then specify your desired variation width, height and font size. I'm going to set 60 for width, height and 20 for font size. Save the settings and get back to the product font end. You can notice my color attribute is larger than other attributes in this product. If you have variations in the shop archive pages, we have an option to control its size as well. To change shop variation swatches sizes, head to the product archive tab from the swatches settings and specify item width, height and font size. I need to make my shop swatches smaller than current swatches size. So I'm going to add 20 for width, height and 12 for font size. When you're done, save the changes. Now get to the shop front end. You can notice my shop pages swatches are looking small. I think you got a clear idea to control swatches sizes in product page and the shop pages. I believe you have found this tutorial helpful. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.